morning y'all it's currently 7 8 in the morning and i'm just doing a little vloggy vlog because um today we are getting luna fixed y'all she's so mad she right here i got the cage open so she can get out or whatever but she really don't care for car rides so she probably just gonna sit there like that she don't even know what's going on today my my baby's starving she eats since six o'clock yesterday night appointment is at eight so we 26 minutes away and we gonna see how this go and then i'm gonna like show y'all what i'm doing for the rest of the day now she want to come out look she's climbing all over my car go ahead mama oh lord go you okay hey luna Okay, y'all, it's 12.03. I want my friend so she can go and get her hair done. Um, I saw y'all a little clipping of her. But right now, they got me on a food run. So, we are going to get Miapa, the Cuban restaurant. So, we're going to see how that go. I never had it before. My friend Amani had it before, but me and Zay did it so this is gonna be our first time trying it so y'all come with me the place y'all it's 119 I just got my food and I'm just not getting back to the girls y'all I'm so mad I'm gonna just say this never go somewhere super hungry and wait on food it's gonna irritate you way more than it usually would. But I'm gonna show y'all what we got. <laughs> Eating big. So we got yellow rice, black beans, we got some garlic sauce, and then this is cool. There's Luna right there, ready to go home. We're picking her up. It's five. So we back in the car, and I'm so proud of my baby, y'all. Look at her. She aggravated. I know, mama. We going home, but. I'm so proud of y'all, y'all. She, they said she did a good job. She did not pee or poop in her cage. She used the litter box. Like she didn't fight them. She was just so friendly and just cute, y'all. So I'm gonna take her home. It take a week for her to heal. She can't jump on no furniture. She can't go outside, you know, stuff like that. But I know my baby hungry because she ain't ate since yesterday, six o'clock. I gotta get her some treats, y'all. I gotta do something. I gotta do something. Time to go home. We going home. We going home. Y'all, look at this view. Look at this view. Look at my teen teen. My whole stomach on. Look, she ready to bother me. So, after everything I did today, I did my mom's hair. Then, after I did her hair, we went skating. Y'all had to turn the sound off because, you know, when you skate and they play music. And I'm not trying to get copyright. But, yeah. So, we hanging out with the grass. No. Because we're going out to dinner, <laughs> trying different drinks, y'all. This drink is disgusting. This is a Bloody Mary. Don't you ever, ever, ever get it. It's like an alcoholic drink with freaking tomato juice. Don't do it. This is us hanging out, jigging the music. And yeah, like today was a good day. We did so much stuff in one day. I didn't even think it was possible. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Coupon and look like. Oh, baby, tissue on sale. You want to be somebody so bad. But thank you. Girl. What's your bad yeah, for you? I miss you. On, I ain't even got on the good one. One, two, three. Come on, I can't crack this. Right. Hold on. Yeah, he made these candy, candy yeah. pickles. Huh? That bit look crispy now. She short. No, <laughs> no, no. Them cute, girl. Ooh, bite it, girl. Bite it. <laughs> oh. Just hold 
Hey y'all, so I got the She Reads Truth Bible. It's a Christian Bible from Amazon. I think it was like $20 or so. Yes, they have different colors. And y'all, I'm really trying to learn the Bible and understand. And I feel like after I done my research, this Bible was the best for me. Um, the King James, James Bible is way too too much for me so i needed a little simplified version um so i could understand and break it down in english terms on um, what i am reading so i think this book is amazing it has everything you need um it has different pictures and stuff it has um the uh key verses and it has different maps and timelines and you know all type of stuff to help you read and dissect the bible and it has the um bible in a year and the genre guide to it just in case if you wanted to go back to different topics like historical you know things like that and the bible in a year is actually good because it gives you different scriptures a day for you to read and those scriptures act actually have dig deepers to different stories that help you understand what you just read if that makes sense y'all so i absolutely love this i got it from amazon like i said um then i went to bells and actually no i got these from amazon as well and they more they more sturdier than what i have but i got these markers um the ruler and this book this notepad from bells and i absolutely love it just for me to take notes and you know for it to be cute and it says trust in the love with all your heart and then this thing says good things come to those who wait just you know positive things you know and i also started writing down the bible in a year in my notebook how the fuck is we in these people's stuff <laughs> Okay, tell us and ask us ladies, are you okay? Yes, we okay, baby. We just try to get these candles, baby. We try to get these candles. Because we just did so much stuff. Like, oh, y'all know I go to school. So I went to school. I went to school. I woke up. I actually went to work. Went to work. And then as soon as I got off of work, like at nine. Ooh. Ooh. Excuse me, I went to school. When I went to school, oh my God, we had to learn how to do perms, which I'm gonna upload that video and show y'all how it turned out. Oh my God, wherever y'all go and y'all get your hair done, do not get a perm. Yes, the perm is beautiful, the process, not that, not that long really, maybe an hour, hour and a half, but the smell, no. I cannot walk around with that smell. Oh my God, the smell, the smell made me so sick. I was sick for the rest of the day. Smell like rotten eggs, like just, but worse than rotten eggs, just, ugh. And it, like, it was hurting my head. Mind you, I was at work. I had to cut onions. Cause nobody did onions. So my hands was smelling like onions all day. That was getting on my nerves. Then I go to school, just for school, to smell like rotten eggs. Like, tell me if you're going to smell, you're going to feel good and smell good after that. No. So after I got out of school, around 5 o'clock, my bestie was like, let's go shopping. Because she wanted to get some house decor and everything like that. Y'all, uh, click the link down below. I'm, I'm going to add her on the... Um, in my bio and y'all need to go see the kind of footage that i got for her because at first we were just going shopping for, for her but you can't go shopping with your friend and not get nothing so yeah y'all i was feeling so 
sick for the rest of the night. My head was like out here. Like I didn't have no Tylenol. Mind you, I've been gone since 4 a.m. I didn't get home till 10 o'clock. Yeah. So sleeping. And then, hold on, bad review. We we tried this Latino place or whatever. And it was disgusting. Like we got quesadillas. I don't even like quesadillas like that. But I was like, mmm. Can't go wrong with steak and cheese. Got steak and cheese. And I'm like, hmm, if I add bell peppers, maybe it'll be like a Philly cheesesteak kind of thing or whatever. So I did that. First of all, I got the food. The bell peppers was not even cooked. It was just raw, crunchy bell peppers on there. The steak tastes like pulled pork. Like, it was giving very much pulled pork. Okay. And then it was just nasty. Like, for all four of us besties in school to go to lunch there, it was $50. And then they charged us $3 a drink. Mind you, we only went because somebody gave us a good review. And obviously, either they pick and choose who they want to put their love in to their food. But Oz was not it. So that had me feeling sick as well. So I didn't even eat all day because of that. Like, I literally, actually online, I literally had to go to Vitamin Machine and, like, get some chips or whatever. And something to, well, I already had a drink. I had to get some chips because it was nasty. And then all day, I'm, like, burping, you know, belching and stuff like that. And it was nasty. All I taste is the bell peppers in the steak and drunk. Like, so everything was just making me feel so sick, bro. So sick. I was ready to go home, but I had a good day. So yeah, let's show y'all. Let me show y'all what I got. So we got Burlington, we got TJ. I'm talking about TJ Maxx. We got Burlington, we got Ross, and we got a little bit of Hobby Lobby. So basically she went shopping for Christmas stuff and house decor. I went shopping for just house decor because it's only me and my husband. We don't do all that. like. Whatever. Not talking anybody who do all that if it's just them and their husband or them and their boyfriend or whatever. We just personally just don't celebrate that kind of stuff. But, um, yeah. So, I got a little bit of house stuff because y'all know I just moved and I'm ready to clean my nail room and dress it up or whatever. But, I'm starting with one house at a time. One part of the house at a time. So, this is just basically the living room kind of thing. So... We just start with Hobby Lobby because I only got one bag from Hobby Lobby. And then from them, I just got our letters. Like, I spent $24 on these letters. So I got this, I got a K. K is for my first name. N is for our last name. And then I got an A for his name. So, what I'm going to do with... These are actually pretty uh, sturdy and heavy, right? They heavy, but not really heavy. Um, yeah. So, anyway, Hobby Lobby right now, definitely since it's about to be Christmas time, they got, I'm sad that they don't have a lot of house decor, but they whole store is filled with Christmas stuff, like 60 and 50% off of everything. So, y'all need to go ahead and do that. Uh, but, yeah, with these letters, I think on my living room wall, I'm going to put them some kind of way and have all of our pictures around it like our wedding pictures and all our crazy pictures throughout the years of us being together and stuff like that so we're just gonna have a whole wall basically dedicated to us because it's our house so why not so yeah So I'm gonna show y'all what that look like. So we can do this bag right here. So I got this nail organizer from, that was the only thing I got from Hobby Lobby. So now we can do Burlington. 
I got this from um Burlington. And my bestie helped me pick this out. It's it's a mail thing and then you can hold your keys on the side. I'm mad because I had with the Amazon and basically got the same thing and it was cuter. And it came broken because I didn't even read the freaking reviews. I just wanted it so bad. And it was broke. So I never got another one. But me and my husband, we just be throwing our keys wherever, like on the counter and stuff when we come home. So we be looking for them when we leave. And yeah, no. I want it to be cute. So then I got some body wash. Some Dove body wash. Which is Yuzu Fresh. Dove Go Fresh Body Wash. Oh, Japanese. It's okay. I just grabbed some because I know I was running out of my other one. Oh, it smells like baby. I don't know why I did that. But yeah, we got that. Then I got some towels. So I guess you can say I got a little bit of bath stuff. I got a towel set just to have extra towels. And I'm going to tell y'all the price of each one. So I got some towels and I got that. And then I got some toupees. So I got that. And then for the good part, y'all. So I consider Burlington another Ross, another TJ Maxx, and another Bells. Basically, that's what it is, because that's what it was given. Like, so with that being said, though, what I did love is the fact that they have candles, right? Now, what I'm gonna be mad about is the fact that these candles, if I like them and they don't smell good, I'm gonna be so aggravated. Because I hate that. Like, that's what Bells be giving. And that's what Walmart be giving, for real. Like, as soon as you get a candle, it smells good in a store. As soon as you get home and you light it, it don't smell like nothing. It's not strong enough. Like, I needed to be giving bath and body without giving bath and body. So, I smell this candle already. This is a beautiful color. Like, basically, it's giving my house color. And this is acorns and leaves, y'all. Acorns and leaves. And it say it's scented natural soy wax. So yeah. Mm, I can smell this all day. It smells so good, y'all. I don't know how to sit. So I got that one. And they wrapped them up real nice. So I got that one. That was so, no, I was so mad. Like me and my me and my bestie was in this store for hours. <laughs> like looking for candles and smelling them. Because you know, when it's like these retail stores or whatever, they just throw the candles up there. And you know, a lot of people come across them, so they'll get one or whatever. So literally. Some of these are sets and some of them are not. Like this candle that I just showed y'all. And look at the top. It say thank you. But um, it was only one of these. We sat there for hours going through this whole shelf. It was like three, four. It was actually five shelves of candles. And it was only one. Aggravating. But then we found Midnight Star. And this smells so good. Like, I love, like, a clean smell mixed with men's smell. Because I don't like to do too much. Because my husband, he likes the scents or whatever. But he don't, like, I mean, I guess he really don't care for them. But, like, some of them, the sweet smells be having me sick after a while. Like, I can't be smelling that all day. And these kind of smells do, too. Like, so I'm not going to burn two at a time, maybe. I'll probably just do one. But I heard the best way to do candles. Sorry, y'all. My arm is itching. Oh, the best way to do candles is to put them on a wax warmer so they last longer. They just melt. But, yeah. So I got two of those. And then... I 
I got another one and it's spa it's called sparkling cranberry. It smells so good, y'all. Like look at these. For these to be like $10.99, $7.99, $8.99. Like look at the look at the what do you call it? Look at the Say. look at how they look like they so nice looking like i'm gonna have to figure out something else to do with these when these candles go out so i got these candles so i got those And then I also got this oh, family sign, even though it's just me and him, but I thought it was going to be cute. My bestie said it was going to be cute. And then, of course, before I got it, I wanted to ask him <clears throat> if he think it was going to be cute. Y'all, this was $16.99. $16.99. I got that. Now it's time for Ross. So Ross, y'all. I got these huge outdoor mats. Little basic mats or whatever. Let me not show y'all that tag. Oh wait, so all of that from Burlington was a hundred and thirty dollars. Okay, so this is Ross, and it says oh, "Home Sweet Home." So I got two of these, two of them, because we got a front door and a back door, and we have a lot. We have a lot of dirt. So I got those. Then I got this shower thing for our bathroom. I thought it was okay. And then y'all, I got these pillows. I was just walking around. At first y'all at Ross, I'm like mad, okay. The house colors I want are fall colors, basically. And that's, like, hard to come by when it's not in season. So I've been trying to look. But, like, literally when Halloween is over, they don't care about nothing else. It's like, skip Thanksgiving, we going to Christmas. So I'm kind of mad that, like, none of these stores would have really a lot of house decor. But I was getting ready to leave, and my best friend found these. They say home. They just say home. And they white and gold. And it's orange color. And that is what I love. Because this is literally my living room color. And then. Last but not least. I got these two pillows to put on the end. So these two going to be in the middle. And then these two going to be on the end. Or I might do one and one, one and one. I don't know. But yeah, guys. That's what yeah guys that's everything the price i spent at the price i spent at rice was the price that i spent the total was 73 dollars and yeah so oh wait also i got the shoe rack if y'all ever go to Ross or Bells or whatever, and y'all see these, I recommend that y'all get these because I get these all the time. Like, every time I throw them out when I'm moving or whatever, I always end up getting another one because I just feel like they worth it. Like, you don't need no tools to put them up or whatever. You just literally click this with this and put this with that. So, yeah. That's my little decor. So... I'll show y'all what it look like as the house come along. But yeah, see y'all next time.